Hello Sheraton, happy Wednesday. I know it's been a few weeks since I've done a Wednesday video, but we've had some internet issues and sometimes my computer gets really, really slow and doesn't like to upload videos. So we're gonna try again today. I have a couple of exciting things to share with you. One is some stories that I'd like to read for the next few Wednesdays as back towards school. I know nobody wants to think about it, but it's getting there. And it's from the book, Seven, Happen Seven Habits of Happy Kids. Uh, some of you may uh, remember uh, Stephen Covey and the uh, Franklin Planners and things like that. Uh, this is a kid's version of the Seven Habits of Highly Successful People. And it's super, super fun. And it's a great way to relate to kids and actually grown-ups too about things like being bored or not prioritizing tasks well or um, how to plan something from start to finish and it's a lot of fun and it's a cute storybook. So I'm going to share some of those stories uh, starting this week and then I also have today's craft kit which is I just call fun foam. So if you are familiar with the foam with the sticky back or the that foamy stuff um, that's what we have for you this week and it's really just a variety of foam and you can do with it whatever you like I highly recommend you don't stick it to walls or furniture it's hard to get off uh, it can be done especially if you have a scraper tool something like this um, or one of those pampered chef scraper things for a, a pot that's dirty um, but I recommend using paper or something that you want to decorate that you're not going to be washing. And uh, there's also some foam sheets in there of various sizes. So feel free to pop in and take whatever uh, looks exciting to you. Grab a bag of the little sticky foam, take some of the extra foam. It does stick well to itself, so it's a fun way to make 3D art. And then I also have our geodesic dome kit, which is so exciting. And I want to give a shout out to Liz at Ellie Box. If you are not familiar with Ellie Boxes, they are really, really neat. And I will put a link uh, below the video to Ellie Box. Uh, but she's on Facebook and on Instagram. And she creates these uh, monthly boxes for kids that have some kind of manipulative things in it. So there might be Play-Doh or kinetic sand, and then there's little picks and things, and it's all on a theme so that kids can um, use their imaginations to create a scene or create a world. And she has created an amazing bag for us for the geodesic dome kit, which is in collaboration with um, Iowa State University and Outreach here in Lucas County. And so this is an extra special program. There are 50 kits and that's all and you are going to want to grab one. They're amazing. The bags they're in are amazing. Everything about it is really, really cool. It's a really special and exciting thing. And those will be available starting Friday morning at 10 o'clock when we open. And they're only here for as long as we have them. So make sure you pop in to get those. And make sure that you come and see me at the Lucas County Fair. So Saturday from one to four, we have kids at activities. Uh, there's a different activity every hour on the hour and the activities themselves won't take an hour. Um, it's just that activity will be available for that hour, probably more like 45 minutes so I can set up for the next one. But Mrs. Hobbs is coming to do the very first one with me. It's a bubble painting. And then we have all kinds of different things. So some of them are crafts. Some of them are more steam related where we're just going to kind of experiment and play and draw some conclusions um, there's a couple of times we're just playing with kinetic sand it doesn't have a craft or or something to take home um, we got some instruments and some bird calls and some fireflies and we got all kinds of fun stuff it's going to be a great time so saturday from one to four and then monday the 26th tuesday the 27th and wednesday the 28th we will be uh, providing activities from 10 to 4. So again, every hour on the hour from 10 to 4. And on Tuesday is Clover Kids Day, or it's Kids Day, and there will be some extra special things there. The Clover Kids will be doing their expo, and there will be an opportunity to see 
uh, see the barns and maybe learn some more stuff um, around 10 o'clock or so um, going through the barns and seeing the different animals and then we also have an extra special story walk that day going from the end of the sheep barn the end of the barns all the way to the donation garden which miss logan got a really neat grant for and this garden has been providing produce for our food bank right here in sheraton and so we'll have a story walk with activities going from the barns to the garden and then provided we get it all set up there will be a story walk uh, called read across the fair that will be uh, the county fair story about Almanzo Wilder and his giant pumpkin and uh, That's going to be a lot of fun. It will be kind of the premiere of our library story walk the one that is um, Movable so we can put it in different locations. So we're really excited about all these things. It's library. It's extension. It's county fair It's 4-H. It's Clover Kids. It's preschool. It's everybody So be sure and come and see me at the fair be sure and pop in here to the library check out some books Keep working on your reading logs um, Oh and August 11th is going to be our grand finale party and we know that the matinee movies, the free matinee movies, have been a hit this summer. And we're excited to, um, to work with Vision 2 and provide one more this summer. Uh, this is the last one in July is today. And then next week is off. And then August 11th, we will host uh, two different movies at 1 o'clock and two different movies at 7 o'clock. So they are free. The popcorn's free. You can come to one at 1 o'clock and at 7 o'clock totally fine. It's for the community to celebrate a community of colorful reading all summer long. And um, at one o'clock, we have The Wizard of Oz or um, Meet the Robinsons, which is probably my favorite steam movie there is. And then um, The Wizard of Oz and it will be amazing to see that on the big screen. And then at 7 o'clock, we have um, Matilda, which is the one with Danny DeVito, and it's absolutely hilarious, and it's great fun, and it's based on the book Matilda by Roald Dahl. And then the other choice is escaping me at the moment. It is... Um, Nanny McPhee. If you have not seen the original Nanny McPhee, you need to see this movie. It's so much fun. It's it's just such a fun story, a nanny story, and it's got really cool sound effects, and it sounds really neat in the movie theater. So we're excited to, to bring that to you um, August 11th. Uh, again, free popcorn, free movie at 1 o'clock and at 7 o'clock, and there will be other concessions available for purchase. So come out, support the movie theater, come out and celebrate a great summer of reading. Come and see me at the fair. Come and get your stuff here at the library, and I can't wait to see you soon. Have a great day.